Every day when we're hungry enough, we sit down to eat. And later on, we get rid of the waste. But something happens in between those two events. Something that makes us lighter. The first person who studied this was an Italian doctor who lived in the 1600s. Uh, who lived in the 1600s? Thank you. It was here that a young doctor by the name of Santorio Santorio, also known as Sanctorius of Padua, was conducting an odd experiment on himself. He carefully measured the exact weights of what he ate and drank. And then he did the same with, well, you get the idea. He built a specialized chair to weigh himself while eating. As he ate, he gained weight. That made complete sense. The curious thing was that an hour or two later, before he went to the bathroom, he got lighter. He lost oh. weight. Somehow mm. matter was escaping his body invisibly. But how? Sanctorius treated hundreds of patients over many years, and he weighed them too. He found out the same thing happened to his patients. They ate, they gained weight, and they got lighter. Sanctorius realized the weight of more than half the food we eat leaves the body not when we go to the bathroom, but before that, invisibly. Sanctorius never figured out what that invisible matter was, but later scientists discovered the answer. The food you eat is made of molecules such as glucose, which has carbon in it. The air you breathe has oxygen in it. Inside your cells, carbon-rich glucose from your food combines with oxygen to release energy. In the process, carbon dioxide and water are given off. You actually breathe out some of the matter from your food as invisible carbon dioxide gas and water vapor. Even though you can't see these gases, they are matter and they weigh something. So every time you breathe out, you get a little bit lighter. You lose weight just by breathing. <laughs>